let's go through a basic scanning sequence step by step, beginning in the lower left quadrant. So for comfort, I'll have the cord resting on the patient. The patient is actually holding onto the cord for me. I'll position the scanner or the lower left buckle, go to the most distal molar. And to start, I'm actually going to give the system an occlusal view. And I'll press the green foot pedal to capture my first scan. Now I'll roll a little bit to, towards the buckle. And now I'll just move one tooth mesial, keep moving forward, pressing the green foot pedal to take a scan. As I get towards the anterior, the scanner is going to turn with the shape of the arch. And I want to scan just beyond the midline. At this point, I want to take a quick look see that I captured everything within this buckle quadrant. So far things look good, so I'll continue by pressing the pink foot pedal, pressing green to say next segment. So I'll begin at the same spot, the second molar, this time from the lingual view. And again, just moving forward and pressing the green foot pedal to take a scan. Now that I finish the lingual side, I'll press the pink pedal once again. Click the green pedal to say next segment. And we'll scan the right side. Now repeat the process on the right side, beginning with the occlusal view and rotating to the buckle, moving one tooth at a time, pressing the green foot pedal to take a scan. Now as I get to the anterior on the right side, it might be easier for me to switch hands and holding the scanner. As we fill in the lower right scans, the IOC scanning software stitches the two quadrants together at the midline. When you're happy with your scans on the occlusal, press the pink foot pedal, then the green to move to the lingual scans. Okay, so the lower arch appears to be complete, so I'll press the pink pedal. Press green, taking the next segment. And now we'll capture the upper right buckle. Same process as the lower. The first buckle scan will be a little more occlusal. Then I'll roll it towards the buckle. And move mesial. And just like the lower, I want to go just beyond the midline. I want to review, in this case, I'm taking a look at the gingival margin of the second molar. And once I'm happy, I'll press the pink foot pedal. Press green to take me to the next segment. Now, unlike the lower, when I get to the anterior of the upper, I'm not changing the orientation of the scanner. So I'm no longer following the arch from the lingual side. I'm keeping a vertical orientation. And you may notice in the viewfinder, it may not be perfect focus all the time. And that's okay. The viewfinder is purely for positioning purposes. When we take a scan, it is always in perfect focus as we capture at over 300 focal depths. We continue with the upper left buckle and upper left lingual scans. As we fill in the scans, the IOC scanning software stitches the two halves together at the midline. And now it appears like the upper arch is complete. So now we'll scan the bite. Press the pink foot pedal. Press green. And the system will ask me to capture the bite from the left side. And I can scan the bite from anywhere on the left side. 
I want the vertical line to follow the occlusal plane. I want an equal amount of the upper and lower. And I'll press the green foot pedal to capture the scan. The occlusion will come together. And just to confirm that occlusion, I'll press the pink foot pedal, right green, side. and scan the right side. Now, depending on the type of application, you may want to capture more of the palette. So I'll press the pink foot pedal, press the green, and we'll capture the palette, basically starting at the midline. And we'll work our way back. just as far as we need for the application. And then we'll work our way towards the sides. So I'm working my way right towards the dentition. Now go back towards the center and scan the left side. I want the scanning tip as close to the palette as possible. So I'll angle the cord ends away from me to achieve that. Let's save this real quick. Once I'm happy, I'll press the pink pedal and I'll move down the menu to view and then press the green pedal for processing. I'm gonna save this real quick.